Hey everyone, I'm here with another video and this is going to be a review of the Broadway Nails Real Life Brush on Gel Nail Kit. It's a mouthful, right? This is what the box looks like. And I'm holding it this way because there's actually three bottles in here and this one keeps falling out. I purchased this at the beauty supply store for $9.99. I did see it at Walmart just last week so um, you can also get it there. So. It says that the formula dries um, in under five minutes. It soaks off quicker than acrylics um, and glue on nails. That it uh, has three easy steps. <laughs> it's not. And 48 short length tips. So you should have enough for two complete applications, it says. So uh, the three, there's three jars here. This is the, the gel, this is the activator, and this is the brush cleaner, which I'll explain in a moment. And then also it comes with uh, like a nail file. It comes with like a little orange stick, right? What's they call the orange stick? You use it to push back your cuticles and clean under your nails. And um, then you have the tips. So they give you um, French tips and then they give you regular tips if you wish to apply that and then put like your own nail color over it. So, um, I was interested because um, I've been hearing so much about uh, like gel, gel, why do I keep saying gel? I keep um, hearing so much about gel manicures and all that and I just haven't had the opportunity to go to like a nail salon and really get a professional one done. So I saw this one day and I was like, oh, let me give it a try. You know, it's only, it's only 10 bucks. It can't really be uh, that much. So this is the gel and this is what you uh, apply to the tip. So you're going to take whichever tips it is. So let's say you're going to take like the French tips, which I really like because they all have, by the way, these little, um, little, you know, tabs on it. So you can very easily fit them to each of your, uh, your nails. So you will have already uh, set aside the 10, um, the, the tips for your nails and then what you're going to do is after you've uh, removed any nail polish or anything you have remaining on your natural nails you're going to take the tips and then apply this gel to it and apply the tips right to your nails right then when you're done applying all 10 what you're supposed to do and this is where it becomes a little bit tricky um, you're supposed to take the gel now and apply that to each of your nails from the cuticle all the way up to the, you know, to your tip. So over your entire nail, including the tip. Then you're supposed to apply this little activator above that, above the gel. The thing about it is that you have to dip the brush, okay? You're supposed to dip the brush from the, uh, from the uh, brush cleaner and apply it into the activator and that's how you apply the activator, then you have to keep dipping it back into the brush cleaner, I guess to keep this from uh, uh, building up uh, onto uh, the brush. The problem is that you are supposed to apply the activator while this is still wet. So you're trying to do it really, really fast and this stuff is drying in between. Um, once I did apply it both times, um, I felt that with the French tips, you could absolutely see all the gel on it. it kind of um, no matter how careful I was with each nail it did kind of gather at my cuticle because it's a gel it just kind of like solidified um, and gelled onto like my cuticles and it wasn't pretty and I thought maybe okay the first time it just you know I just didn't do it well it ended up being that way the second time I tried and then when I was halfway through the second manicure and I was trying to like fix it up and like redo some of the nails um, when I tried doing it in some places the third time I still couldn't get it right so um, this probably didn't work out uh, very well for me now with the French tips it looked better than with the regular tips when I tried to apply my nail polish uh, my regular nail polish over with the regular tips uh, just because I didn't have to apply that extra layer of uh, polish over it so with the tips you would just leave that alone you could uh, apply like a um, top coat or anything like that if you like um, the soft pink uh, French nail uh, uh, French manicure nail look you could do that go ahead and put um, a coat of uh, that over the gel after you do it but the problem with it for me was that by that time after you've put on the two or three coats of the gel activator combination it's gotten so thick that yes it does provide a really good thick layer over your nail so it cannot break easily but it's so thick that you can't apply anything over it which is why when I used it with my regular um, nail polish like when I put the regular tips on not with the the French uh, manicure when I put 
it on with the regular nail polish it just did not go well I, did, I could not find any nail polish that went well over it it just did not apply evenly I had to keep applying it then it would like uh, it, it just didn't do well for me okay also I want to say that they say you're supposed to get two uh, applications out of it and I uh, just barely did so um Maybe I'm a, a klutz, maybe I use too much of the product, but I just barely got two applications out of that. And I really didn't like it because um, I had used up this, this product here, the gel, and um, I haven't seen this available for purchase um, on its own. So I guess I am just, you know, out of luck until I buy the whole kit again to get more gel. I don't know. Um, also, you could definitely see where the tip met your uh, nail bed with the French um, uh, manicure. It just, um, it was so many layers that you could definitely see. And then of course you could see like the whiteness. So like around uh, around the, the cuticle. Um, yeah, I, I, I was disappointed with uh, this purchase. Um, I, I would try this again if they changed the step system up a little bit. Uh, but yeah, it's just not for me. If you guys have any comments, questions, or responses, please leave them in the box below. If you haven't, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, take care, you guys. Bye.